We're here today to help you sort through the solutions for low carbon products. Stay with us. Welcome to The Mix. I'm Jackie Clark, and this is the Lafarge Wholesome Discussion about issues of interest to the industry. Today, we're going to talk about low-carbon cements, and Todd Laker is here with us. He's in the Salt Lake City office, and he's been with the company for more than 20 years. So he's got a lot of knowledge to share with the audience today. So I'd like to welcome now Todd. Thank you, Jackie. I'm excited to be here on The Mix. Well, it's great to have you here today, Todd, and I know we want to get right to the core of the discussion, which is telling the audience about the ways that you can reduce carbon in cement and concrete through the use of blended cements. Sure, Jackie, yes. As you said, one of the best ways to reduce carbon in our concrete is through the use of blended cements. And blended cements are simply ordinary Portland cement with supplementary cementitious materials either blended or interground at the manufacturing facility. Um, Lafarge Holsim has a long history of blended cements with fly ash, slag, natural poslins, and limestone. One of the easiest blended cements to incorporate in a concrete mixture is our OneSem product. OneSem is a Portland limestone cement that's engineered to be equivalent to ordinary Portland cement in both performance and durability. One sim can be incorporated at the manufacturer's facility and the manufacturer still has the option of adding additional supplementary like fly ash or slag. Lafarge Holsim has a long history with um, Portland limestone cements with over a thousand lane miles of paving in the west in many structures across the country. Todd, I think it's important for the audience to learn about why it's significant to shift now to the lower CO2 cement and concrete, as opposed to, say, waiting another five or ten years. Now, that's a great question. Um, concrete is the second most used construction material on the planet, and it has such a great benefit to so many people. And so it's important for us to address uh, carbon now and reduce it as much as possible so that we can continue to provide sustainable structures and infrastructure for generations to come. Well, Todd, you've made it very clear that lower CO2 cement and concrete products are here to stay in the marketplace and that our products at Lafarge Wholesome help customers make the right choice. Thanks, Todd, for joining us here today. You've certainly outlined why lower CO2 cement and concrete products are here to stay. Thank you, Jackie. It's been a pleasure. For those who need more information, please do talk to your Lafarge Wholesome sales representative or just hit that subscribe button below to follow us for future episodes. Finally, you're always welcome to visit us at materialsthatperform.com. Thanks again for joining us for The Mix.